Yo, what up? What's happening? It's time for another fact, likes, comments, subs- Hi. Uh, this is a, a common thing that happens to people. Look at these three shapes. They've all got transparency applied to them individually. You can see all the parts sort of bleeding through. That's fine, but what if this was a character, right? All of its bits, its appendages, its facial elements would be coming through. That's not how you want things to be fading away. We want it to be flattened, a unit. Well, have a look at this node structure. It's got three independent transparency for three independent drawings. That's that's inefficient, that's lame source, that's a bit of a rookie mistake, so enter the composite. If you've not seen a composite before, it'll blow your mind face. These things are all about efficiency, they, uh, they're good. Uh, so if we put lots of threads into it, put them all into one, and then it can all go into one transparency, just like that. Look at the efficiency, and it's, it's flattened it. It's become one unit piece, it is all becoming transparent at once. So again, if this was a character, the whole thing is now treated as one bit. That's awesome. That happens a lot. However, what if you didn't want it quite like that? You wanted this sort of halfway thing where you wanted the efficiency of this, but not the combinationingness of this. Press the yellow button, it will open up the layer properties. It has this mode here. This is as bitmap. It has another one called pass through. The pass through does it, well, it passes the strings through. All of them are still combined into one string, but all of the drawings are still kept as their own drawings, so you get what's happening here. Everything still passes through it. This is probably used way more often, like 90% of the time. It's pretty rare that the bitmap mode is actually used, to be honest. Uh, but the bitmap mode is the default setting. Every time you pull a composite out, it will be set to bitmap and you'll have to go and set it to this. Uh, so it's easily overlooked. If you've not seen the pass through setting before, it may change your life because there's lots of <laughs> common mistakes that come up because of it. I'm gonna show another one to do with Z space. So if you've got lots of layering issues, uh, happening, uh, give that a shot. And I'll explain exactly what's going on there in the next video, because cliffhangers are fun. Yeah, cliffhangers are fun. Bye.